Hey y'all, it's Saturday. Gotta get ready for work, AKA the playground, AKA Sephora. Let's do this makeup. One thing to consider is, when you're doing your makeup, do your makeup routine based on you, okay? I know a lot of you, like myself, have follow a lot of amazing influencers. For instance, myself, <clears throat> I follow Jackie Ina, Savannah Silver, Taylor Mae Jane, and those young ladies, those ladies are younger than me. And so I was doing my makeup just like them, and I realized, you know, it was too much product for me. So basically, tailor your makeup routine based on you, okay? I'm 51, I don't need to use a lot of product on my face. I don't want to use a lot of product on my face, but I found a makeup routine that works best for me. Okay, brows are done, lids are set. I'm only going to use one shade of eyeshadow, and this is from the Chocolates Palette from Julia's Place, and that's it. Only one color. Shadow is on. Let's get these lashes on and then we're gonna go to the base. Lashes is on. Let's get to the base. I'm in with the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. Oh, oh Lord Jesus. That's okay. I got extra. <laughs> Underneath. But also make sure your skincare is on point as well. Yeah. Makeup baby. I also like to set my primer with the NYX Bear With Me setting spray. And make it the last day while I'm at work. Color correcting with the Ulla Henriksen color correcting stick, and this is in the shade Apricot. This is contour with the milk contour stick. Now I don't contour my forehead because it sets my hairline back like LeBron. So I just do my cheeks and my jaw. Now I like to do the underpainting technique. I learned this from Taylor Mae Jane, who is also on YouTube. I'm going to use the milk concealer. Um, and basically when you do the underpainting technique, you use less product. So just a little bit of concealer here and on the outer corner. That's all you need, especially if you're using a full coverage concealer. I do not like to take my concealer all the way under my eye like, like this. I don't like that. That's, that's just too much product for me. Um, and then I'm going to use the Hourglass um, Concealer in the shade Maple. And I'm just going to do a little dot here, a little dot here, here, and here. Blend out that concealer and those highlighted areas. This Maple Hour, from Hourglass is a full coverage concealer. So you don't need a lot, trust me. <laughs> learned that lesson a while ago. I'm not going to blend out my concealer in my eye yet. I'm just going in with my foundation. And this is the House Labs one. Um, I got this in gratis. I'm just going to do one pump. Just one little pump. This is a full coverage foundation. And I'm going to spray my foundation with some setting spray. Got that from Jackie Ida. And blend that. Mix that up in there on the back of my hand. Looks like that. That little bit and on my face. Then my real technique brush and just coating my brush with the foundation. And we just gonna blend that out. One pump of foundation is all you need. I feel like you use less product. You know, makeup is supposed to enhance your beauty, not cover your beauty. So one pump of foundation, that's all you need. concealer. <laughs> you can probably wear it as a foundation. I like to use brushes under my eyes because they blend out so seamlessly. Alright, sponges. If, you, if 
I use too much product because that sponge could pick up the excess product. I'm using the ultra pink powder from one size. Taking a puff from Amazon. These puffs are amazing. I love them so much. I'm just setting under my eyes. I love this powder from one size. Oh my gosh, it's my favorite. Finish ah. setting under my eyes with the shade of Tilbury. Spray is Ben Nye Pine of Seal. Love this setting spray. It does your makeup stays on all day with this setting spray. Here is the finished look. Y'all have a good day.